Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a review and I'm actually going to be reviewing the Magic Sleep Suit. If you guys haven't heard about it, it's supposed to be this magic suit that helps babies sleep. And I'm gonna let you know, did it work for my daughter, did it not? What were the pros and cons? And pretty much that's it. So let's just get started. If you haven't heard about it, this is the Baby Merlin's Magic Sleep Suit. And I have the size small. It is three to six months or 12 to 18 pounds. So my daughter's actually 14 pounds right now, which means she's semi in the middle, you know what I mean? She still fits in this thing pretty good. It's a really decent size. It's pretty big if you can see. And her feet do stick out. I know if your baby's a little too small, they don't stick out, but her feet do stick out, which is a miracle because she's not the tallest baby, but she's getting there. So if you haven't heard about the suit, this is actually supposed to be a sleep transition from the swaddle. So if you were swaddling your baby, your baby has trouble with the reflux, the, um, the uh, startle reflux, this is supposed to be really good and help control it so that way their arms aren't flying around everywhere but the arms are sticking out so they do have that control. I think that the main thing about this is that it's supposed to be kind of like the weight going down on it, that it's supposed to be a little heavier so that helps them sleep better and it kind of helps their startle reflex calm down and not go all over the place, you know what I mean? So it is pretty thick. It looks pretty thick actually. Like when I first saw it on Amazon, I was a little intrigued but I was kind of scared because my baby does sweat a lot. She gets really warm easily so I have to have something, I have to have her dressed really lightly at night. So this is 100% cotton and when I put her in it I just put a onesie, just a short sleeve onesie and then some socks because her feet do get cold in it. And it worked out pretty well. I mean she was warm, she didn't get cold, she didn't get too hot so it was perfect. And I keep the room usually at about 70 to 72 I want to say so she's pretty good in it she's it's not too bad so I'm actually gonna go to the website and see what they claim to be so it's actually created by a mother who is a nurse I believe a mother of four and a pediatric physical therapist so reading that right away I felt like comfortable with it I was like okay this person must know what she was doing creating this and I think it should work out pretty well and I read so, so, so many reviews on Amazon before actually purchasing this, mainly because it was $40 and who wants to spend that kind of money on something that's not gonna work, right? It has two zippers, two on the sides, and it just opens up like that. You put the baby in, then you zip it back up and she's good to go. So really simple, right? Well, on to my review. The first night that I had my daughter in this, I remember I put her in, she was about maybe almost four months, so she was about late three months, and I put her in the suit, and immediately she was wondering, like, what the heck is this thing? So we put her in her crib, and she's actually never laid down flat in her crib without her little, without her little snuggle thing that I have, and we just put her flat in there with that on so she fell asleep within I want to say five minutes which me and my boyfriend were really really shocked we were like maybe this really is magic maybe it works like amazing right if you don't know my daughter does not sleep very well she's probably the worst sleeper and she only sleeps about three hours maximum usually that's usually the longest we can get her to go and that first night she slept for five hours so we were like I think it works. I think we're gonna start getting some sleep. Wrong, no. After that five hour stretch, she began waking up every single hour. And that's when we were like, okay, maybe this thing isn't so magical after all. And I just remember thinking, is anything ever gonna work? Like, what are we gonna do? Maybe she's not ready to be transitioned from the swaddle. Maybe she still needs it because her arms, she was still going crazy moving around with her arms and then she began kicking her legs up and down and it was just a whole big mess. It was just a new thing. So I was reading a little bit more reviews and people say that if it doesn't work the first time, just keep trying it for a few more days and then if not those few days, try again maybe two weeks later. So I want to say we've had it already like a good two months almost and still to this day, it still doesn't do its magic that it's so called. My daughter will sleep maybe three or four hours really good the first half of the night, and then after that, it's just back to every two hours, every one hour. It actually got worse when we put the suit on. I don't understand if it's because maybe her arms were too free and she just couldn't 
she just still needed her swaddle but it did not work for us and it's kind of sad because I wasted $40 on it and I heard so many great reviews but maybe it's just my daughter she's just not ready to sleep better on her own or sleep through the night and I hear so many people saying that my baby sleeps through the night already my baby's been sleeping through the night at month one and it really gets me jealous you know I want to try out all these different things but in the end I think trying out so many different trying out all these different techniques are just not gonna work until she's actually ready so for now we're still sticking to swaddling she is four and a half months now and we're still swaddling her just her arms not her legs but we do occasionally use this thing when we want her to sleep really good like through her naps because it does work really good during naps because like I said she will sleep pretty good for the first half of the night so She'll sleep maybe an hour or two in her naps, and I think it's really good for that and kind of helping transition them into the crib. So I would say a plus for transitioning to the crib and maybe for the naps, but sleep-wise at night, it didn't work for us. And maybe it works for you guys, maybe it doesn't. This is just my honest review, and I just wanted to give you guys my opinion on it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments. Have you tried the magic sleep suit? Did it work for you? Let us know. Take care. Bye.